Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watch me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe But that's alright Hush MC squad so what's up I feel like I haven't used my voice much on this channel so hi if you're new and if you're not welcome back today we are going to be doing a missing Claire Q&A because it's been a while and I actually have my microphone on because I actually filmed half of this video already and it wasn't on so fun fact for you but it's all right um Anyway, we have a lot of questions from Grace, and one from Grove, and two of these guys, please put them back in the comments because for some reason I got the notification, but the comment is gone, it's not in spam or anything, so it would mean a lot if you could re-comment it, but you don't have to if you don't want to, but anyway, let's just jump right into it. So, um, so she asks... Can you give me a quick rundown for season four? Um, so actually I'm going to make an entire video talking about season four, the cast, the story, just everything. That way you can have all the information in one thing. Sorry if I had to make you wait or anything, but I promise it'll be worth it once it comes out. Um, because it'll have a lot of useful information, at least I hope it's useful. Alright, let's, uh, let's get going. Alright, so, first question is, how did you feel when you found out about your brother? I think you definitely know already. I felt scared and kind of weird about it, but at the same time, I was excited to try and meet someone I've never met. I was also kind of mad my dad was a player, but, <laughs> you know, we're just gonna ignore that, but still think the whole thing just hasn't sunk in yet and the realization of it is just really big you know the next question is how many stuffed animals slash plushies do you have i have quite a lot and most of them are like fox owl or horse related i have more horse ones i got one custom made that looks like eva and sometimes i sleep with it and a lot of the time i uh have to like hide it from myself because i like cry every time i see it but yeah, um, how do you feel about the foxy mask that you have? It's kind of hard because on one hand I love it and the other hand I hate it because it caused so much emotions for me. But I think those emotions were crucial in order for me to grow stronger. Do you ever want to meet Terrence again? Uh, no. <laughs> Uh, he's probably still a brat. He was a brat when I first met him, and I'm never going to talk to him again. Opinions on FNAF as a whole. I mean, I think you already know. I love it. It's art, and that's all. <laughs> and finally, favorite FNAF character. Grace. Come on, you already know. So yeah, now let's have Claire answer the questions Grace has for her. Come on. Ugh, finally. Took forever. Ow, hey, watch out. Oh, God. Sorry about that. Yeah, thank you for the questions. Let's get started. Okay, how did you feel about Scar always being tired? I mean, I feel like I'm way too energetic, so if anything, it's not that weird. Most people are pretty normal compared to me, so I guess I don't really tell the difference. Favorite color besides pink and purple? Uh, I guess I like, I mean, I haven't really thought about it. A good color would be black because it goes with everything, especially pink. Um, what are your opinions on FNAF? I am not at all as into the fandom yet, um, but I've been trying to get into it since you and Yulva have been pestering me about it right, really recently, but there's just so much confusing stuff about it, like, who is, is William My Michael Exotic Butters, or, like, I, I don't understand any of it, so. Do you have any siblings? Uh, no, 
actually I'm the only child which is actually really sad I guess that's why I've always felt like whenever one of my friends leave I've always kind of felt down about it because like I've never had a sister or a brother so when I have a friend that's kind of the closest thing I have to it but when I don't it's hard for me because it's like losing a sibling favorite game to play besides Star Stable I really like dress up games not like the cheap generic ones but like gotcha life and stuff I just really like getting my creativity out you know all right all right time for the best questions questions for Miss and Claire in general why did you create the series so funny thing miss sinclair started out as a mini movie because at the time i watched a lot of britney water night april oakfall etc and i was really inspired to do my own i said hey let's make a mini movie but then i had to go to walmart or something and we were like hey why don't we just make this a two-part series and then i found the perfect opportunity to do a cliffhanger on the second episode so it just kind of evolved from there and I'm actually really happy it did just because I feel like it's the best story when it goes from something little to something big and hopefully one day Miss Sinclair will be more than just a Star Stable series but who's gonna pay me to do that so <laughs> um why did you create the channel I felt like I was making so much Miss Sinclair content and no one was really watching it besides the cast and I thought hey why not have a special little space for the MC squad and that's kind of what happened and I'm really happy to this day and I wouldn't delete it even after Missing Claire's over just because it's great having just our small little fandom getting together. Favorite season and favorite episode to recreate. That's very interesting. Favorite season, uh, I would say season three. It's just so good. And I think it would be fun to recreate the first episodes. They're kind of cringy looking back. Like the story didn't make sense. I fixed up the lore recently and maybe one day I'll do a full on thing talking about it. But for now, uh, let's just say like the se season one finale, I would say just cause that one had a lot of stuff that I wish I could have gone back and fixed with it. <laughs> Alright, the next question is, is there ever going to be a voice acted series for the channel? If so, I want to be in it. So, after Missing Claire is, like, the main part of it is over, we had the first generation from season 1 to 3. We'll have the second generation, which will maybe go from 4 to 5 or maybe even 6. And I'm planning to have a spin-off series, possibly, if we're still going by then with like school girls I do like voice acting in that i also want to try doing some projects of like mini movies and stuff so yeah i'm sure i could find a way to do some stuff but i would love to do more voice acting involved things as soon as possible um are we going to get more art slash edits yes definitely um i have a new one coming very soon um, I have several planned. I just have only one actually ready to go. In character's favorite colors. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be doing a part three or two. I don't know what you call it, but I'm going to be doing more. So just please make sure to keep on asking questions and I'll be sure to answer them. Also, I just wanted to say thank you guys for all of the support. I've been having some technical issues with the episodes, but hopefully we'll be able to get them all sorted out. So thank you guys for watching. Bye! FC Squad out! I must be dreaming cause I don't believe in ghosts, yeah